Hello friends, welcome back to the channel and to what I think is going to be kind of like a work with me vlog situation. If you're wondering why is the lighting horrible, why is your background chaotic, I'm in the upstairs workspace where I usually work, keep my inventory, photograph, steam, all of these beauties back there want to be steamed and photographed. What we're doing today is, I have so much stuff to do you guys, but I could film like several work with me's. Also I'm trying to stand in a place where I don't have shadows on my face and my glasses are not reflecting. Anyway, what we're gonna do today, it's like 5.30 or so on a Tuesday. So I already worked today and my kid is around, um, but what I need to do is I really need to get a start on a huge pile of shoes from probably months ago at yeah months ago at this point that have just been sitting around because I had to clean them and they took longer to dry so when I photographed shoes the last time they didn't make the cut and my thing is with photographing shoes I just need to be in a specific mood to bring myself to do it it's not like it's hard or anything but what like it's hard the cleaning portion is what sucks so I have shoes that have not been cleaned I have shoes that have been cleaned and just need to put shoelaces in and all these shoes need to be photographed I got them from several different places I will try to point out which places either on the screen or as I'm working so we're just gonna see how that goes I normally don't clean shoes up here because my bathroom that I have up here is like tiny and dark and there's just not a lot of room to navigate but I think we can do it I don't think any of these shoes are so like dirty or in such a bad condition that they need major cleaning, I think we'll probably just wipe everything down and that should do the trick. So let's see what we're working with. Also, my kid is calling me. Okay, so let me just show you some of the things we're working with. Again, the lighting is horrible. So, I have these Supergas, Superga, whatever. They, I cleaned them. The problem is that I, you know, washed the shoelaces and I never put them back in. I think they came from a thread up box. So that was forever ago. They have a little bit of like a residue feeling, probably because I cleaned them up with the pink stuff or something like that. So I'll just wipe them down again. Um, these, I think, just need a quick little wipe down. I think they're in really good shape though. I got these from ThreadUp. Um, I actually bought these from their outlet section, like assorted brands, because they didn't have them branded. And they're called TM. I don't know if that's how you pronounce it, but I looked them up and they're really pricey and they sell for a good amount. Also, they're size 10, so even if they don't sell, these would be mine. And they're in pretty good shape. They still have the ThreadUp paper in them too. Yeah, TM Core. I don't know if it's pronounced TM or Time or whatever, but they're in really good shape. They do have a little bit of wear on the soles. Up. Like very little though, mostly like little pieces of gravel. And then also from Thread Up, same haul, and I paid up for these, I will say that. I think I have 20 bucks into each pair, but they should go for at least like 70, if not more. These need a little bit of cleaning. These are To Boot New York. I don't know if you can see that in this lighting. To Boot New York. Also in the assorted brands section, and yeah. I looked them up and they looked really good, also size 10, so they can also be mine. They have a little bit of scuffing here, so I'll go over these with a um, magic eraser. Then we got some men's work boots that are in good shape. They don't need any cleaning. They came from the bins. This is some Brahma. I'm trying to put things where they need to be. I got some Steve Madden's or Steven by Steve Madden. I got these from the bins. They're lace-up boots a while ago. They're good to go. I think I don't think they need any work. Yeah, I think I'll just list them as is. These I cleaned and washed and now they're all shiny. They were really nasty when I showed them in a haul previously. They're for joy. So these are good to go. They can be photographed um, here. And I'm gonna run out of space in about a second. I'll also show you my makeshift setup for photographing shoes right now because that always moves around. I have a specific spot where I take pictures of clothing because I have a hanger on the wall, etc., and the lights are kind of set up, but Shoes, it kind of moves around depending on where I am and where I want to take pictures. All right, these need to be photographed. They were on a haul. I forgot what brand they are. Something cheap like Shoe Dazzle or something, but they don't need any work. Same goes for these. I forgot what brand they were. Also showed them in a haul before. Basically everything I've shown you in hauls since probably December needs to be clean and photographed. These little kids are Jordans, they definitely need to be wiped down, but when I actually looked them up, they looked really, really promising in terms of what they go for. So yeah, I'm excited for these. They stole the sticker from Goodwill. These definitely need to be cleaned up though. 
Uh, we got some BCBG Girls that I picked up, I think, for a trend video. Yeah, because they're metallic, so I really need to get these listed. Good lord. It's been forever! Oh, good. Yeah, so these are kind of like metallic looking ones. Uh, these need to wipe down as well. I got these comfort shoes that need to be... Actually, they're good. I think they're good to go. These wild ones, I'll give those a wipe down. Oh, and I have a whole bunch of like Sanook flip flops. I'm not going to show you all of them right now. But yeah, they all just need to be wiped down as well. And then I got some boots, which I forgot what these were. Probably also something like Shoe Dazzle. Oh, they're CL by Laundry, so Chinese Laundry or something like that. Yeah, anyway. These are in pretty good shape though. Torrid. Yeah, we got some Torrid. They also phew, they also need a wipe down, so yeah, nothing super duper major yucky. These are from a recent haul. They're the Lucky Brand boots I showed from my uh, Dollar Tree haul that was not Dollar Tree, wow, from my Dollar Day haul that was so amazing. And I got some Sorrels in here too. They're kind of stuck, so I will get started on all of these, film a little bit of the cleaning and photographing process. I'm not sure how I'm going to set up for the cleaning process, like where I'm going to put you guys, but we'll figure it out. Okay, welcome to the greatest camera angle ever. Uh, again, I usually don't use this bathroom for anything other than, you know, the bathroom if I'm working upstairs, but that's about it. So let's see what we can do with these shoes and get these clean and ready to be photographed. Also, if you hear weird noises, it's me trying to put these annoying gloves on. That are way too small for me, but here we are. All right, this needs to go. Shoot cleaning ASMR. What? All right, let's see. So I don't know how much you guys can see in the slide, but here's the before. They're kind of dingy and dirty. Put the canvas itself. It's fine though. Let's see what we can do for the after. I do like to put a little bit of goo gone on the magic eraser. That seems to be like a really good combination ah, yeah. just to get the goo off a little faster I don't know if you if it would do the same thing without uh, the magic eraser like just a regular uh, piece of fabric or something but I find magic eraser and goo gone combined are actually kind of magic also my hair is hanging down onto these shoes so that's super fun all right so the front definitely way way cleaner again the lighting is not great for this you're just gonna have to believe me. Yeah, maybe we can do before and after with the two shoes. Is it showing up? Let's try over here in better lighting. Like, do we see the difference though? I see the difference. I hope it's showing up on camera. Anyway, back to work. So we got, I think we cleaned everything when it's cleaning. They're all kind of hanging out here on my window. And drying. And we have a few more over here. And then this is my provisionary, is that the word? Photo setup for these shoes. Uh, I'm gonna obviously turn these lights on and then hopefully that will all look good. Um, I'll try to give my camera some rest because it's running hot and then I will film a little bit of B-roll of me photographic shoots, because what could be more interesting, right?
Okay, my favorite thing in the world. Taking pictures of tall boots. So we're gonna stuff them with some packaging material. I know people use pool noodles and I do have some pool noodles, but they're all the way in my basement. I'm not getting them now. You can stuff boots with literally anything. Like I've stuffed boots with clothing I was ready to donate just to make them stand up nice and tall. So it doesn't matter. Spears. My work here is done. My work here is done. I've raised you well. What does that mean? That means good job singing along to Britney Spears. Why is somebody doing that? Why does it mean? Oh, because the G stands for gut. The T stands for two, and the OG stands for oh. Got to go. Got to go. Bye bye. Got to go. Bye bye. Okay, bye. Got to go. G G G. Okay, guys, it's a few hours later. I just put my kid to bed, had some dinner, etc. Um, and now I'm gonna pack an order for shipping. I think that's the only one I have. It's some fry uh, sandals. They're not your typical, not your typical fry shoe, but I got them in a thread up box like way back when in Virginia. So I've had them for probably two years at this point. So when somebody sent me an offer for 30 on them, I'm like, yes, take them. They're tiny size too. They're six and a half. So they fit into this tiny little Amazon box, which is perfect. But I'm going to get the shipping ready and then I'm going to sit down and probably list the shoes that you saw me clean and photograph earlier. So I'll film a little bit of that and then, yeah, we're going to wrap up this work day slash afternoon evening typical sort of workflow for me as a part-time reseller a lot of my reselling happens on the weekends and in the afternoons and evenings really so that's just my life the next day.
you can probably tell it's a different day it's actually two days later i started filming a little bit the other day while i was listing but then my sd card was full and this one is acting up too so i don't know what's going on with that but i just god this is welcome to my bathroom <laughs> um i just did a little bit of free listing as i was walking on my um, walking pad it's not really a treadmill because you can't run on it but that's fine because i like to get work done and get a little bit of exercise at the same time i don't use it as much as i should and i'll definitely need to make it more of a habit i got it about a month and a half ago i want to say because um i work from home two days a week and then on the weekends as well i just want to get like half an hour 20 minutes in uh today i did yeah, around 20 minutes a little bit less than that i did about a mile so that was good didn't really like work up a sweat or anything but well yeah a little bit anyway i'm gonna hop in the shower though because i do need to wash this hair and then i'm gonna list some new stuff because yeah i did some relisting i don't know how many items i released probably like six or seven and yeah we're gonna i'm gonna take a quick shower then i'm gonna put my kid to bed because it's uh, after 8 30 and he needs to go to sleep because tomorrow is a school day and a work day for me but yeah well, we're gonna wrap this up tonight i'm gonna list some more things and then film a quick outro and then that's gonna be it for this vlog okay guys so i showered i put my kid to bed i washed my hair in case you can tell by the state of this mop and i'm still not listing because i actually have five things to ship could be six if one person decides to pay for their order on ebay but i got a free people skirt a calvin klein dress a zara dress that i just hauled in my dollar day haul and just listed and then a pair of J. Crew jeans that I got, I think, back in Virginia. Um, I also have a pair of fit flops over there that I just squeezed in this tiny Amazon box that I just got today. They're small size, so they fit, which is great. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna do that, and I'm actually gonna wrap up this video just because my SD card is telling me it's full, even though it's not, so that's probably not gonna end well if I try to push it, but thank you guys so much for joining me on this slightly chaotic work with me. I will try to do better um, with the vlogging. It's kind of been difficult for me to do that just because I have so much going on. I don't wanna add, you know, setting up a camera, etc., all the time, but I'm hoping to be getting Getting back into vlogs a little bit more soon uh, after the summer is over so stay tuned for that also in case you haven't seen it yet this Thursday this coming Thursday we will not have realist and relax because we will bring back the bar oh yeah Yay! Thursday May the 4th we're bringing back the bar it looks like it's gonna be nerdy but it's not Mm -mm. No, we're not going to do all the nerd stuff. We're just going to do our usual little fun-filled hour or two. We'll see how long we can last. We haven't done this in a while, but I really hope you guys will join us. Uh, it's going to be on my channel. It'll be linked up here and also in the description down below. So definitely check it out. Make sure to subscribe if you're not already. Give this video a like and do hit the bell notification down there. That way, you're gonna get notified whenever I post a new video, when I go live, all that good stuff. I try to post two new videos a week. Right now, it's more like one, just because, again, life is stressful. But yeah, I'm getting back into the swing of things. I'm not unboxing things right now, so <laughs> it's kind of hard to find things to film. But I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you got some stuff done, and I hope all the stuff we got done will sell for us. So I will see you soon. This done. Cheese.